In this video, we will learn how to fix api-ms-win-crt-heap.dll is missing. So let's begin. So the process is really easy and simple. Uh, first, go and open up your browser and simply paste in for the DLL missing. So this one and here type in for download. So make this query and hit enter. Sign some of the times it might ask you to verify your that you are not a robot. So simply go and do that. So once we have done that. It would redirect to the search. Here you can see dll-files.com. Simply go and open this. So here you can see. Before going on, you need to find out what kind of system you have. Either it is 32-bit or 64-bit. For that, simply go to your start and type in here for this PC. And here you can see this PC. Right-click it and go to properties. So here against the system type, you can see I have 64-bit operating system. But don't worry, we will solve the problem for 32-bit as well as 64-bit. So first we will solve the problem for 32-bit operating systems. For that, simply go to this link and here scroll down below. Against the architecture 32, simply go and download this DLL file. And it would take a bit of a time downloading, so just wait for it. Once it is downloaded, simply go to your download. Here you can see the file, open it and copy this DLL file. Now go to your this PC. Go to the disk where Windows is installed. So you can see Windows is installed in C, open it. Go to Windows, scroll down below. And here go to SysWow64. Here you can see SysWow64, open it. And paste the 32-bit DLL file here. Click on continue. So once you have done so, simply go and restart your PC and the problem for 32-bit operating system will be solved. Now we will solve the problem for 64-bit operating systems. For that simply go to your browser, go to the download page, here you can see the download page, scroll down below. And here you need to download the 32-bit as well as the 64-bit DLL file for 64-bit operating systems. For 64-bit operating system, we need both files. So make sure that you can see the architecture 32, architecture 64, and make sure the versions are same. So versions are same. Before downloading, I will delete the previous file that I have downloaded. Now first I will download the 32-bit file. Second I would download the 64-bit file. Now 64-bit file. It is downloading. Here we go. So here we I have 32-bit and 64-bit file. First, copy the 32-bit DLL file. Go to your this PC. Go to local disk C. Go to Windows. And here, paste the 32-bit DLL file in sysvow64 here we go paste it here so once you have done so go back to windows folder now copy the 64-bit dll file this is the 64-bit dll file copy it go to windows here paste the 64-bit dll file in system32 go to system32 paste it here once you have done so simply go and restart your PC and the problem will be solved for 64-bit operating systems as well so hope it has helped you in solving the DLL problem for 64-bit but before you go please like subscribe and share thank you